Okay, I, I don't know if I'm live yet. I should be live, but anyway, hope you guys can see this. Carrie Lynn, how's everybody doing? I've been meaning to come by and visit you guys, check on you. It's been some time since I saw y'all. But I think about y'all, your mom, your dad, sorry everybody, Jolene. But uh, anyway, I'm going back to this. So now, in Ponca, to be late is what's neat there. Like I was telling you guys, I used to do this all the time. I kind of slacked off. You know, I might have to start doing it again because these are, how you doing, Michaela? These are uh, verbs in Ponca. These are verb conjugations. And then I put a few sentences on them. I'm going to do a little bit. Like I said, if you guys really want to learn, you know, you're going to get it. And if people don't want to learn, you know, they're just going to do it like they do anything else. They're just not going to pay attention or not going to do it. But to be late, it's what's needed. When you say, I'm late, you say, oh, what's needed. Oh, what's needed. Or some people say, oh, what's needed. Oh, what's needed. How you doing, Leah? Okay, now when you say you're late, you say, what is needed. How you doing, Arthur? What is needed. What is needed. And then when she say she, he, or it's late, but we just use she's late. What's need that? What's need that? Okay, now when we say we're late, we are late. What was need that? What was need that? What was need that? We're late. You are late. You say what is need that? What is need that? You are are late. Now when you say they're late, you say what's need that? What's need that? She, he, it, and they, and, and some verb conjugations are identical. Not always, but in some. But this in case, it's identical. So when you say that, what's need that? They're late. And if you say they're really late, like they've been late, you would say, and this is how you tell too when it's different, even though they use that same word, what's need that? On the, on the top one where you say she's late, or she has been late, you would say, What's need that the ke? What's need that the ke? She had been late. And now for they're late, the same word, but change it. You would say, What's need that don't ke? What's need that don't ke? They had been late. That's past participle. Okay, now we're going to move on to something else. It's the same thing, but it's just different ways. Can you guys see it good? I hope you can. I got an iPhone. I got two phones, but this iPhone, I'm still having, uh, I don't know, I'm just like I said, I'm slow at technology. Okay, this first word on top, it says, don't be late. That's a man's way to say it, and we also say it the woman's way, but it's wrote in a man's way. What's need the ajiga? What's need the ajiga? What's need the ajiga? And if you say it the woman's way, like I told you guys, the five letters that we don't use, I've made it clear that we don't use it, but it still have been used throughout Ponca. And, and I know a few of the, you out there teaching, you guys are really on that. But all through 100 years, Ponca's, and yes, we have to correct that when they say the L or they say the Y in it. But I still know the difference. But like I said, but when people talk common and uh, fluent Ponca, a lot of times it, it's, it's said that way. It's just the way it's been. And any of you that know Ponca, you wouldn't understand that, and you know it's true, too. Now, is it correct? No, it's not. But it's been spoke that way for over 100 years. So right here in the woman says it. She says, What's need the ajia? What's need the ajia? You got to raise it on the end. And that's a woman's way to say, Don't be late. What's need the ajia? Don't be late. And right here, when you're talking about, man, you're late again. Sheepy, what these need the. Sheepy, what these need the. Sheepy, what these need the. You're late again. And so when you gotta do, when you say that like that way, and then you, some people might say, "Why well, can't help it?" You say, when you say, you say, "Ain't we can't, ain't we can't manage." Or you could also say, ain't we can't blea. I couldn't help it. But anyway, I'm just going to start doing short lessons like this way. I think it, 
I don't want your attention span to be too far off because when I believe when it's a little bit shorter like this one, when I show you different things like uh, I might do another one tonight on clothing and, and uh, attire, or I might just let you guys do this. But like I said, you got to want to learn to speak this. And I'm going to start putting verbs in here because when I teach my class, I'm not doing a lot of verbs in it because people don't. Now, some people say that these guys aren't ready for this, but I'm telling you, if you guys want to learn Ponca in any language in the United States or the world for that matter, if you can't conjugate verbs, you'll never be able to speak that language, not semi-fluently, not anything. And so it's something that you got to want to do. So we'll go over this briefly, quickly. To be late is wasnide. I'm late. On wasnide. You're late. Wadisnide. She's late or he's late. Wasnidai. We're late. Wa wasnidai. Wa wasnidai. <clears throat> you are late. We're pluralizing it right here. That's why I got those red marks on. You're late and you all are late. My motion light just went out. Wadi snidai. Wadi snidai. You all are late and they're late. Wasnidai. They're late. And then one more time. Right here. Wasni de ajiga. Wasni de ajiga. That's a man's way to say don't be late. And a woman's way is wasni de ajia. Wasni de ajia. Don't be late. And you're late again. Sheepy wadi sni de. Sheepy wadi sni de. Sheepy wadi sni de. But you guys have a good evening. God bless you guys. Shana.